Thank you for tuning in. This is the NZ Radio Guy. Um, I'd just like to show you in this video, uh, give you a few hints and tips and pointers on how to uh, keep your radio equipment uh, protected from lightning storms. Uh, currently, we've got one going on outside, so I apologize if there is a uh, interference. Um, anyway, what I've done to protect my equipment is I've disconnected all my aerial cables um, and packed up the uh, all the uh, telescopic antennas and so on, um, just to uh, minimize their um, their effectiveness. Um, because you don't want, uh, an aerial is an aerial, it will pick up um, radio signals as well as electrical fields and you don't want the, um, the aerial transmitting um, the current down to your equipment and uh, damaging it. Um, another thing I've done is I've disconnected all my transmitting equipment from their power supplies so I'm not able to switch them on and hence I'm not able to transmit and damage the equipment because it hasn't got an aerial connected. Um, I suggest you uh, you follow the same general procedure for um, when you uh, go away on holiday or uh, leave your station untended for uh, a while. Um, it just uh, means that if anything does happen while you're away, you know your equipment's um, safe. Anyway, thank you for tuning in. I hope you found this uh, video helpful. Um, please leave your comments, questions, and uh, please don't forget to rate this video. Thank you very much. Have a good day.